Welcome back, everyone, to Mob Balls Australia. It's uh, the good old AD bringing it back with my pal, Enthusiastic Andrew. That's right, Enthusiastic is my first name, but technically it's my middle name. Now, anyway, we're going to be reviewing this wonderful ball. This is, well, you may be looking at it, it's a black ball. It looks like it's bouncy, but you know what? The funny thing is that that is not the case with a squash ball nine times out of ten, okay? This is a squash ball, okay? Now, how the squash ball actually gets its its bounce is by heat. Now what you need to do is you need to, when you, before you play a game of squash, you usually need to put it down like this, get the ball, drop it on, and then do this. You know, like that, like squash it, or uh, rapid hits with the racket, of course. And basically that gives it the, uh, the, the heat, and then you can do things like this, you can bounce it properly. Now it's very hot outside, so you can actually, you can actually bounce it, but usually it would just go, like that. You need to use force. The more force you use, the more warm the ball is, the better. Now, this is a one dotted squash ball, which these ones without a dot are usually a lot more bouncier for professional, you know, for, I mean, for beginners. Uh, so someone like Angus, someone like me would play on that. And then there's also ones with two dots, which mean even more so, where it's like you would have to whack the absolute shit out of it to actually be able to do anything at all um, with the ball. So you got, it, basically there's three levels of squash balls, I guess. There's also ones with red, and now I've never really used them before, but it apparently, yeah, I mean, yeah. Squash balls are usually this color, uh, black, maybe because of the course usually bright, so you can see it, so it's like the outlier, you know, where you can actually see it. Um, and you know, you can see like, you know, like the wear and tear of the court on there. You can see like, like all the shit that's, you know, like the weird wood or plaster or whatever they've done or paint. Paint, I mean, yeah, the ball, the balls absolutely go whack, you know, which is uh, quite good. We may even show some shots of us playing squash uh, present soon. So yeah, I mean, squash balls, fantastic ball. I would honestly give the squash ball, I reckon, a nine out of 10. Nine? If I had to rate it, I would give it a nine, not uh an eight. That's not trying to be popular and appease the inside jokers. I'm serious when I say that I reckon this is a 9 out of 10 ball. Almost a perfect ball. Balls are good. Balls are fine. If I had to rate the squash ball, I'd give it a 9. Isn't that right? Thanks for watching Isn't everyone. Isn't that right? Keep your balls 